Seven. What ho! Finally made it back, I see. And you managed to give my old charm a leg up. That strange tree where you met him has been known since ancient times as the Tree of Sticks. It's all too bally easy to lose your way around it, not realizing that your innings is over. But now the old beans realized what's happened to him, and he's safely on his way to the afterlife. You know he, Boren, was the first Sabercat ever to open up his heart to me. Absolutely terrific chap! It's thanks to him that I've got where I am today. And that's precisely why I couldn't leave the job unattended to go and help the old boy myself. Hmm? What am I doing? Of course, I haven't explained yet, eh? I'm the chairman of the great Sabercat Trust. I know. Why don't I make you a member? It's the least I can do after all your help. You have this. It shows you're one of us. The bell is your proof of membership. It'll call a nearby Sabercat if you ring it in the right place. Hmm? What's the bell called? It doesn't really have a name. I suppose that'd make it a bit of a pig to you, eh? Righto! How about we call it Bormran's Pearl, eh? In memory of a good friend and a fine old gent. Thanks for your help. Remember now, always keep the saber cats in your heart. What?
Surely it's too dangerous to carry on pursuing this fiend. I mean, look at what he did to Golding. Huh? Who are you? Interesting. I thought there was no one on this island besides us and Golding's murderer. Let me give you a piece of advice. Steer clear of the old ruins in the middle of the island. Ignore me at your peril. You have been warned. <laughs>